Before we dive right into editing dialog, let's take a minute to see what makes up a post-production project. What we are looking at on screen is a feature film that was assembled by the editor for the sound department. The editor and director sit in an edit room going over all of the footage that was shot on location and decide what is good and what is not good. They assemble the footage together along with the audio to create a rough cut, an early version of what will be the final picture. And that is what we have here. Elements that were recorded and then arranged according to the director's vision. I will break these elements down in greater detail in upcoming videos. So for now, let's take an overview approach. The basic elements that you will find in a post project are the video track, the guide track, the production dialogue or known as principal dialogue, and production sound effects or wild sound. These are the fundamental elements that you will find in any post-production project. Now, depending on the editor or the director, you may also find other elements such as music cues. Or you may even find library sound effects. This is generally how you will receive a project from the editor. This type of deliverable is generally considered the standard as it has everything that we need. Copies of the same project will go to other members of the sound crew, like the sound designer, composer, etc. Generally, the editor or the assistant will separate the elements, putting them onto their respective tracks during the assembly of the cut. For example, all dialogue will have their own tracks. All production sound effects will be split onto their own tracks. Music will have its own tracks. Here you can see that this is a much smaller project, but it contains all of the same basic fundamental elements. The guide track, the principal dialogue, and the location sound effects. However, not all editors work the same way or follow the same standard. Here we see a project that contains only the dialogue recording and whatever sound was recorded on set as well. The dialogue hasn't been separated from any of the production effects. Further to this, depending on the format of the project, you may only receive just the production audio, but no video, as is the case with this project. The video is separate and will need to be imported in. I will talk about project formats in greater detail. Understanding how a project is laid out is vital when it comes to the post-production workflow. In the upcoming tutorials, we'll take a closer look at these production elements.